Hello everybody and welcome back to Crash Tag Team Racing. This will be part 35. Um, in the last part we found a secret power crystal over halfway through Tyrannosaurus Rex. We did the Battle Arena Extinction Party and we got and we did the race in track 3 um, Tyrant Ice. In this episode we are going to redo Rolling Thunder, cra uh, Crashinator, Running Gun and Fast Lap. And yes I did say redo because I did them and I got them done, and I beat all of them after 20 or 30 minutes of trying. And it turns out my computer deleted that specific part of the recording for some reason. So, I get to redo these. Fun, isn't it? They are at least, this is Crashinator, by the way. They are at least not as hard as La Brea Carpets, I will admit. Although Crashinator and Running Gun were surprisingly hard in this map, so I know that from experience. You know me and uh, Rolling Thunder, that was easy enough, but Fast Lap wasn't that bad either. But the real the real problems for me were Crashinator and especially Running Gun, which was surprising. But remember, since we're doing it as Coco now, we don't have nearly the firepower that we would if we had Nina or Crunch. So, yeah, you'll see then but right now I should focus on this crashinator this crashinator as you can see we're hitting penguin bowling pins isn't that fun um yeah so there's a shortcut there but I'm not gonna take that cuz it's crashinator and the pins are on the actual track uh, we'll probably see that in fast lap it took a few tries for me to do fast lap but I keep on focusing but um it wasn't that bad Crashinator on the other hand and running gun. They were bad. As you can see by my fail. My fail. Yeah, so I pulled out a silver. And I need six more of those to do it. So fun! Alright, great. Good start. Um I live for reckless behavior. I live for reckless behavior too. I live for reckless behavior. I am just a regular speed demon aren't I um anyways so yeah this is a fun day for me my recording equipment went on the fritz um I just had to restart the recording again after doing it for two minutes because it decided to drop 480 frames in a single minute which I, I don't even know if that's physically possible but apparently it worked um honestly my just my equipment is just going haywire right now and it sucks the only high point of my day so far has been not the chores but more along the lines of getting to play Conker's Bad Fur Day after forever um, getting the chance to play a little bit of that it's a great game I still say it's underrated though it really should have been a more famous game I'm gonna fail again Uh, 32 so slowly improving okay I'm just gonna go ahead and cut ahead to when I get it I need to get some stuff out of the way and do two go throughs of crash nader to get it all out of the way so cutting ahead awesome guys I pulled it out got 40 so yeah 41 no 40 40 okay whatever I'll live with that so yeah crash nader wasn't all that bad it took a couple tries but since I'm now used to it you know it's alright um Oh, I just wanted to say a quick fun fact about myself, you know. Um, I... Wow. Okay, uh, sorry about that. That little silence there. But that was just me noticing that during that second part of the race, I think, um, my recording dropped 147 frames during that small race. I'm not sure if that was during the small race or during one of the races in which I was talking. Hopefully it wasn't. Um, because I talked during two races, and if I cut one of them out, that means that it happened during that race. So, that's fun. But anyways, I just wanted to say a quick little, um, quick little fun fact about myself. I love hats. I wear lots of hats. I am practically a hat collector slash enthusiast. About 80% of my hats have been eaten by my freaking dog, who, love him or hate him, I mostly hate him, but... Still, he's a lovable guy, so I get over it. Um, 
But yesterday I got a new hat, a fedora, and I'm happy with it and I think it looks good. So that was one of the good things of my day yesterday. And uh, die. Yay. By the way, um, I'm going to say it again. Engine, best ever on Rolling Thunder. He just is. Choose engine. If you know how to play engine, choose engine. It's not really hard. You just got to aim with the rocket launcher. Whoa. Yay, I killed everybody. See, if I can kill people on something and win it by a landslide, you know it, there's something cheap in the game. That shouldn't happen. I'm so terrible at video games. It is your destiny. Midair? Oh. Arrivederci, Coco. So, my, as you could see, my high score from last time I did this was 36. So, I'm hoping to match that. Or beat it. Better yet. 35, 36, 37. I beat my record from the last failed recording. Yay. 38. Beat it by a little bit. That's over double the score needed. Wow. And that was just in one take. See, I've never had to do multiple takes of Rolling Thunder. Ever. It's just so easy with engine. I mean, doing it for the first time on the first tracks um, in Mystery Island, even then it was pretty easy doing it as a Cortex. But as engine, it's not even fair. It really isn't. Um, I know that running gun is faster, is worse than fast lap for me personally, so I'm going to go ahead and do fast lap. Because that's how I roll. I'm going to do fast lap before run and gun. Starting a new trend here. Eh? Eh? Maybe it'll catch on? Eh? Eh. Probably not. Oh, man. I just figured, um, in Mystery Island, you had to do run and gun as Crunch. And happily ever faster, you had to do it as Nina, who had slightly less firepower than Crunch, so it was a little harder. And this one, you have to do it as Coco, who's got less than Nina. So, who's next? I mean, if they have a new person for each and every uh, running gun, um, then I'd think that they'd force you to use a character who wouldn't be very good at it in the next area. Well, what's it called? Tombtown, I think. I think it's called Tombtown. Uh, go. Okay, okay, okay. This didn't take too many tries last time, if I remember correctly. Um, I think it might have taken, like, five. That's not bad. Can I make it? Oh, I might get this in one take. One take, baby! One take! Yay! One take. Oh, my God. Well, all you gotta do is do it exactly like I did it. If you do, then you win. And I got a new record, too. I beat my old record, whatever it was. But it must have been by less than a half a second, though. Yeah. otherwise, I'll, st I'll take that. That one take, man. Jeez, one take on Fast Lap? What you talking about, Willis? How'd I, do ju how'd I just do one take on Fast Lap? Man. Game must have glitched or something. All right. The dreaded running gun for tire and ice. Oh, shit. Um, you're shooting the little planes out of the air like you did back in Mystery Island, or I'm not sure how many times you've shot planes. I know that we shot them back in Mystery Island. And, uh, you need 40 for gold, and there's 49. So you can miss 9, which seems like a generous number, right? Well, shooting them as Coco? Not fun. Not fun. Not fun for me. See, I already missed one. I remember, um, on the failed recording, on my third run, I got every single plane leading up to the ramp. So I got 25 out of 25 leading up to the halfway point. And I was like, oh, wow, I'm home clear. Nope, I failed it by 8. So of the remaining 24 planes, I hit 8 of them. Now, and that's just because these curves, for me, they're really hard. Okay, I'm already doing better than I used to. Okay, maybe not. 
Yeah, I'm definitely not. Uh, 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 no! 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 I failed by one. I failed by one! I almost got that in one take also. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and cut ahead, then we'll call it a day, because... I gotta start getting in some short episodes. I've gotten into the habit of uploading like three, four, fifteen minute episodes in a row. So cutting ahead. All right, so guys, I got a new high score, of 43. Um, my old one, I barely beat it. I got 40 uh, for the gold, so I didn't get the new record in my failed recording. But this time, I got 43. And in that last run, um, oh, in this run, I got 26 out of the 27 original planes, and I only missed the last one. So that was pretty good. Um, so yeah, I'm happy with that. And this ought to be uh, maybe a little over 10 minute recording, maybe a little over 11 minute, I'd call. But, yeah, so I'm happy with this. So, okay, thank you guys for watching this episode of Crash Tag Team Racing. In the next episode, since we're completely done with this place, we're just going to go ahead and head back to Midway and get the Tier 3 cars. Isn't that cool? Uh, or maybe it's the Power Crystals, I think. Well, well okay, we're going to figure it out. We'll leave it a mystery. Um, so, thank you guys for watching. Until next time, see you guys later.